what's up it's natalie welcome to welcome back to my youtube channel so today it's kind of gonna be a mixed kind of vlog um i'm gonna work out i just put on this like sports bra i'm also 36 weeks pregnant almost there and i feel like everything is getting super tight inside therefore i should work out it is currently 1 40 and I want to like at least do like a 30 minute workout if that just to like move my body around a little bit And I feel like it's gonna help a lot with the way I feel and I'm also gonna do laundry today I'm also gonna put in the footage of me going to the spa because I went to the spa a couple days ago And it felt amazing kind of gonna be like a mixed video, but it's okay. We love just editing my video which is this video i'm also doing other work related stuff um but i'm trying to keep ahead of everything so yeah that's basically what i'm doing for right now i'm gonna do this probably for it's 2 30 right now i want to get at least half this done until four and then figure out dinner which i'm thinking chick-fil-a but i don't really know we'll see we'll see this one really fast hi guys what's up welcome to or welcome back to my youtube channel so in today's video let me go get a brush got one so today we are going to the spa 35 weeks pregnant and like a day i think my back killing me i've like never had this much back pain in my life i've seriously haven't gotten out of bed all day and my appointment's at 3:45. Right now it is 2.35, so it's in exactly one hour. And I'm getting a pregnancy massage. I've heard this could really, really help. And at this point, I will pay any amount of money for my back to feel somewhat better. So yeah, that's what I'm doing today. So yeah, I'm just going to put my hair up very, very slick bun because I did not feel like washing it. Because if I'm oily after the spa, I'm gonna have to take a shower. And I don't wanna have like oily hair. I don't want to have clean hair and then take a shower again, you know? So we're just slicking her back and I'm stupid. Oh, if you guys don't even know, I'm at my mom's house right now. Hence, like all the Disney um, decorations. I didn't bring any other bra with me other than this pregnancy bra. But you can kind of like see it a little bit. So that's really annoying. I don't want to wear makeup at all today. So I'm going in with this moisturizer for my face and my neck i had like the weirdest rash that just happened on my leg and i don't know if it's like a stress rash or what it is but i get it kind of often but not as bad as this one and it was on my right leg i'll insert a picture right here why does my leg look like this it's like not cute obviously not fresh obviously and I don't know why I get get it. Like it's always like every couple months I get this rash. Only like in certain spots. So my mom Googled it and it said that it could be like hay fever or like allergic reaction or like if you're wearing some, some, something scratchy, it could happen. But I've literally been in a big t-shirt like all day in bed. So I don't know. It also said it could be from stress, which I am stressed out. So I'm going to the spa today. I'm also going to the spa because my back obviously is killing me. Um, so yeah, now out of breath. Cool. Yeah, I'm only putting that on my face. I also really haven't eaten much today. I've had two donuts and some club crackers. Just because I'm like not hungry. Not hungry. I also need to get gas. That's like another thing I have to do today. Hi, Mamoos. You're a good boy. You're such a good boy. 
excuse the room looking messy and the loud fan right there but it's like hot in my room um but this is my outfit also 35 week bump update what we're looking like very cute but i got this from shein this bra is from target and it's like short so i can just slip it off for the massage i'm going to get ready okay let's go get gas maybe get a little snack and then go get a massage So right now I'm in the nursery. I just got out of the shower. I have a couple of things I have to do. Um, I have laundry over there. We got her some more newborn stuff like pajamas. So now I want to label each of these drawers. I have my labeler right here. And yeah, that's basically what I'm going to be doing for a little bit. And then I also have to sanitize her formula maker, all of her bottles, all of her pacifiers. I think that's it. Well, I tried to do it. I got one done. And my mom basically gave me a labeler that had no tape in it so that's always cool um so i can't do that today so i guess we only have hats this is what it looks like literally just says hats it's really aggravating whatever well now i guess i will sanitize all these bottles and i'll throw in probably the pacifiers as well and i, I don't know if i'm like supposed to clean this or i don't know if i'm like supposed to All the, I'm supposed to. I know I'm supposed to because that's like really dirty. Like, oh shit. I'm gonna clean this out. Thing, I don't know if this like pops out or I don't wanna break it. It's like really nice. Let me figure this out. So I think what the game plan is because I have like a lot of stuff in here. So I think I'm going to take the pacifiers and teethers and boil them like in the pot. And then for bottles and everything else, I'm going to do my sterilizer. And then I'm also going to hang them up to dry. I just sanitized this. But the only thing with the sterilizer is it doesn't dry really good. And I don't want like buildup in these bottles. So that's basically why I got the dryer rack. So yeah, that's basically what we're gonna be doing. pacifiers and teethers. This is now getting all steamy and then when this button turns off, it's supposed to be done. But that's still going, I still have all of this. I think I'm just gonna boil all of this and then just dry the bottles. But these are glass bottles, which is pretty cool. And I have the pacifiers, I'm letting this sit. I don't have it on anything. Um, I just wanted to kind of boil away what was there. I'm gonna leave this in for like five minutes probably. So yeah. Also, someone asked me in my last video, could you answer a question in your next video? Have you had any embarrassing or TMI symptoms like lots of gas, 
farting during your pregnancy. So that was posted on my 34 week bump update and I actually have had a lot of like embarrassing kind of TMI symptoms. Um, I would say the first one was during my first trimester and I had the worst acne and someone like for me at least I've never really dealt with acne as a teenager or like ever so it was really new to me like I didn't know how to like handle it obviously so that I just felt like everyone was looking at me looking at my skin and saying like oh my gosh her skin is so bad that's embarrassing and then in my second trimester I started peeing my pants a lot I would like literally sit down and pee just came out and then I would literally sneeze like it still happens and I pee myself and I always say it too I'm like well I just peed myself because I wear leggings a lot and sometimes you can see it was, this is so weird sometimes you can see it and it's really embarrassing however I can't help it and it's just something that is normal because obviously she's like putting pressure down there so that's very very embarrassing and I think lately my last one would probably be talking to people if I talk really fast or like a long time I get really really bad heartburn and like almost like an acid reflex and it's like it almost sounds like I'm burping but I'm not I'm like trying to catch my breath and like my chest is like literally on fire other than that though it's been going good nothing like too embarrassing or like too TMI I don't think um and I think I'm just at a point I mean this might be TMI but it's okay I will tell you guys anything I think I'm just at a point since I'm 36 weeks I'm getting very constipated which is not like me you guys have been following me for a while I like to go to the bathroom I enjoy it it's a good time so yeah that has gotten annoying also don't forget to follow me on all my social media i did do a maternity shoot which was unbelievable and the pictures came out amazing i might put that in another vlog i don't really know so stay tuned for that and then i have another big announcement that happened but that will be in another video as well anyways guys that is it for today's video I got a lot done today, thank god. And sorry this vlog was so like back and forth, um, sorry about that, but I'm happy I got a lot done. This was really the type of video that was more like self-care with like a little bit of baby prep. I know you guys are liking the baby videos, so thank you for watching them. Um, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. Ah!